Okay, so you hit your tee shot in the fairway, hopefully, and then you hit your approach shot on the green. Good job. Once you get the ball on the green, you can clean your ball and get ready to put it in the hole. The green is considered only the shortest grass you see on the hole and should be clearly defined. The grass that surrounds the green will be a little bit taller. You'll see the difference. If your ball is on the green and only on the green, you can pick it up and clean it. It probably has grass stains or mud on it. If you want to pick it up, first you have to mark it. You can mark its position with a coin or a smaller object like a tee. Just put the marker right behind the ball and then you can pick it up. Once it's off the green, you can clean it and replace it and then remove the mark and put out. Remember a couple more things about the green. Most have slopes that have to be taken into consideration when you putt. It could make the ball drift left or right of your target or move faster or slower than you thought. Try to feel the slopes with your feet and use the gravity to your advantage to get the ball in the hole. Also remember that playing quickly is important. You don't have to keep marking your ball and lifting it after every putt. If it's clean and not in the way of another player's putt, leave it on the green until you're done. Oh, and here's another little tip for you. Most golfers play by an unwritten rule that if it stops close enough to the hole and they think that you can put it in, it's called a gimme. It's against the rules in tournament stroke play, but if the other golfers in your group agree that it's close enough, you can just add one stroke to your score and pick up the ball and move on to the next hole. Is this a gimme? Okay, thanks.